All right. I figured I'd just do a blog. Vlog. Not a blog. A vlog. Just parting out some uh, Star Wars sets. 75250. Chase. Star Wars Chase. Thing. Um, parting that out right now. Parted out. Just three of those I got on Amazon. Wasn't too many. Here's the extras, the stuff that I didn't have in my inventory. So get those added in there. Um, that's what I'm parting out this week. Last week I parted out 10 of those Advent calendars, Harry Potter calendars. Um, then I don't know what else I got in. I got some other stuff I'm going to show here in a little bit. For this vlog I got some Ninjago sets from Walmart so this here in my store there's some in my store all right that's all my acro mills things I think I'll just show my store real quick this is where I keep all my uh, all my envelopes and stuff bubble mailers um, these I got manuals in here. I used to have my uh, Lego in this and these uh, sandwich baggies. I still got some of it over here in some sandwich baggies, but I've been trying to slowly get rid of some of this stuff because it's just easier to pull stuff when you're, you know, pulling a brick link order, a brick out order. So, yeah, and then of course the stuff that doesn't fit goes right in there. Um, that doesn't fit in the big bins of these acro mills, you know, and obviously the small ones, but that's what I have so far. I have 20 of those, but some of them are full. Usually if I get more out of there, then I'll stick it in one of these. And then I got one that empty. Somebody bought, um, a whole, I had this full of two by six. Um, was it blue? Blue bricks. Somebody bought them all not too long ago. So that was pretty nice. Got rid of all of those, so it freed up a spot. Um, this right here is just a bulk used. It's about 40, almost 50 pounds in there. I got some more upstairs in the house. Um, obviously, my Bricklink store is in my garage right now. Um, but I probably have more room if I get rid of this TV, but it's there for now. That thing's heavy. It's one of them old school flat screens. It still works though. So, but maybe eventually I'll take it down. I don't know. It's there for now. Thing weighs a ton. You'd think it'd be wouldn't weigh that much, but um, then of course you know I put some stuff in these uh, those pick a brick cups right there. I have currently sixteen, fifteen of them. That one's backwards, but yeah, 15. Pick a brick. I think I got one that's empty right now. Somebody bought all my uh, trans trans blue studs. There's like 3,000 of them. Filled up a whole pick a brick and bought them all from me. That was about a month or two ago. That was a while ago. But uh, I started out with these uh, stack-ons, but I got six of those. I got six of those, and then I started, then they stopped making them, so I switched to these acro mills, and I've been using those since, so I got some over here, and then it comes over here, and I got some on this side and on the other side over here, but I was kind of using those at first, and I was using these, like bins, right here, they work, but they're hard to pick out of, so it's always good to, they're, they're nice when you only have like a few of one thing, but that's when I first started my Bricklink store. I started using those just to because I didn't have a lot of space. And I started freeing up some space and taking stuff to storage and you know moving stuff around. And eventually, I got more space so I could buy more stack ons or whatever Acro Mills things. But all right, so that's my Bricklink store for now. I keep my uh, manuals in there. I tried. Started not keeping so many manuals, but 
I keep them in these little Sterilite things. I have got them marked. Star Wars, Mijago. But I've been kind of getting rid of the manuals. Depends on what they are. Like the Star Wars ones, Star Wars ones I might keep. I've been selling a lot of manuals this year for some reason. But they've been they've been uh, selling this year. Normally I only go like sell like one or two a year. But last year I sold maybe probably about ten different ones. Some friends, some city ones, uh, a few Star Wars. I think uh, one or two. What was it? Uh, Harry Potter ones. And it was all small sets, so I was surprised. Unless I'm the only one that's selling the things on Bricklink. <laughs> Whatever. All right. Um, this is where I keep my uh, chain pile stuff. I got... This is why I picked up a few of these. I tried going back to uh, Walmart and picking up some. They had them at 50 bucks, So they're about 50% off. $51. But I think I got these for about 40% off. Maybe 35 um, so I picked up three of those, but they were at two different Walmarts. Um, they part off a little over 200. So that's a good, good part out. I'll get those parted out eventually. Um, got some of those in there. And I got some single sets here. Um, yeah, so some single stuff that I thought I could find more of, but I end up not finding more of them so um, I don't know if you can see them there I'm finger getting in the way there but um, if you want high quality video this is probably not the one you're <laughs> not the vlog you're looking for I guess uh so yeah some city ones I only got I ended up getting two of those but they're 13 bucks so I was like eh I picked them up 13 and these are obviously from the advent calendars I just parted out I parted out 10 of those Harry Potter ones and then in here, I think it's just a couple cases of mini figs that I picked up for pretty cheap off eBay. Got a good deal on them. Um, I think it's some... I picked up two cases of the... Uh, hold on, I'll show my name. Thing here. That's all right. Hold on a sec. Yeah. So yeah, it's a Lego Movie 2. And then these are Disney. Those are the Disney ones in there. Disney Series 2. Those are Lego Movie 2 ones right there. So I got two cases of those. Of the Lego Movie 2 ones. Um, only one case of the Disney. So... Um, the stuff I need to get put in a different spot. Same with these ones. Um, but other than that, that's pretty much my Bricklink store. It's kind of small, the same old. But uh, this is where I keep all my minifigs. Still have some in there. But there's some in there. I've sold some of those already. And then, of course, I mark them Marvel, minifigs, all the way down, Star Wars, and all that down there. So this box is empty. Got some extra bubble mailers right there. Got some fireworks. Want to blow something up? So yeah, there's some fireworks there. Oh, is there where I keep my? Uh, that's how I keep my stickers. So keep them all in here. Got just a binder. You probably find a cheap one there at Walmart because they got a bunch of school supplies on sale. And then uh, I just got some of these. I think these are like the picture ones. Not really baseball card ones or whatever, trading cards. But these are from, like, because they got different sizes you can use. And then I just put some of those in there. Bought a pack of, like, I think it's 20 or something. But you can, different sizes. Like, I put a small one in there. If you got bigger stickers, you can get the biggest ones. But, like, if I wanted to, I just got the real big ones. Those are from the uh, high school, I think. Haunted high school, the hidden side one. High school or whatever it was. Newberry High School. And of course, here's all mine. And then these go. So, I sold for quite a few stickers this year, too. So, and then, yeah, that's all them. But that's where I keep my stickers at. So that way it keeps them straight and organized. So that's how I do my stickers. And then just make sure you don't put it upside down. I've done that before. I'll put it in here, put it upside down, and it dumped some of them out. 
that sucked because I had to pick them up and reorganize them. So, but uh, that's it for now. Um, as far as my Brickling store, pretty quick, simple. But uh, all right. Some of the Lego clearance I got. Got these. Some Final Star Max. Trolls. End up getting four of these Yodas. Um, got these. Ended up getting six of those. Nine of these. I think nine of these sub ones too. Turn that around. So a nice little clearance haul. I'm getting some of these four. Last one's got a couple mini figs in there. And Jago. And some of these brick box light things. They were, they were on sale pretty good too. Almost four times value. So picked up ten of those. Uh, that's the Lego haul if it'll focus. There we go. But that's it. My clearance haul. Got some art ones to the um to the Star Wars one art. We'll see how that goes. I got four of those, but I'm taking a gamble on those probably. But we'll see. All right, so that's my Lego haul so far this week. Not too bad. Check your Walmart's. All right, squid. All right. Just got done with a brick link order. Just one. Uh, I don't think I'll post too many brick link order videos, but maybe I'll do some picking sometime. But just got done with this one, so um, it wasn't too many. I think it was only 20 lots, so quick little order I can get out in today. All right, got this light to help solve my lighting problems here in the garage. So we'll get this one uh, put up and see. Hopefully it'll help out a lot. So dark in here sometimes. All right, got this light. Let's see how it works. Got it at Walmart. Bye. All right, got everything parted out. Everything, though, I left those in the bag. So we'll see. Might just take them out of the bag. When I uh, put them in their bins. But we will see. But not too many parts. I mean, far as like different. Mostly studs. You know. But nice little. I know those will sell pretty quick. So. Um, that's it. I got everything parted out. Separated. So now we just got to put it away. All right. All right. At the end of the week, let's see what we have here. All right, here's my page. Let me get a little bit closer here. Brick Squid Bricks. Uh, oops. Scroll this up. Keep scrolling up. Okay, we are finishing with... Looks like we have... 172,355 items in 4,289 lots. That's what we... We're going to finish the week with here. So, here we go. Alright, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, I try to put one of these out every week. We'll see how it goes. But, um, alright, thanks for watching.